And I was there on the day the monkey came into this world. And his face was round and ready, and his hair was slightly curled. And he didn't look too different from the others I had seen. And who'd have thought he was the answer to the nation's dreams? At first he didn't seem to be intelligent at all. Each time he tried to walk about, he'd stumble and he'd fall. My first impression was to be a most mistaken thought. Lord, a mighty wonder this hairy monkey brought. Since I had witnessed his departure from his mother's womb, I felt inclined to check his progress every afternoon. One day the keeper of the zoo called in the live TV and frankly said, I think you'll be amazed at what you see. The monkey walked and talked and waved his arms about his head. In the corner was a stack of books that he had read. <clears throat> An educated monkey said the papers round the land. And this was more than weary sociologists could stand. His fame was universal. Well, he was on the Ellen Show. And people talked about him kindly everywhere he'd go. And his insight was amazing. His philosophy was fair. And he became a politician welcomed everywhere. And since no one dared to meet him in an open press debate, well, he was nominated by the votes from every state. Yes, the monkey was president, though maybe not the first. And there was peace and harmony throughout the universe. Well, the dream I had last night has been related as it came. As for interpretation, why, it's really very plain. Would you rather have a monkey down in Washington, D.C.? Or have Joe Biden making monkeys out of you and me?